So a man surfs on a dead whale carcass? Man, I sure hope this isn't the whale from Pinocchio. What's up guys, my name is Dave Wapple and welcome to IO. So have you ever gone surfing at all? No, windsurfing doesn't count, I'm sorry. Although it is a lot of fun. Uh. So an Australian man by the name of Harrison Williams was caught surfing on a dead whale carcass. Who the frig surfs on a dead whale carcass, man? So the story goes as he was out on a boat, you know, hanging out with his friends when they saw a floating dead whale carcass out in the ocean. And one of his friends thought it'd be a really cool idea if he went on that thing and surfed it. Now what the worst part is, is that this thing was not just the only thing out there, there was a bunch of other sharks that were eating the darn thing. And heck, when Williams was even on the thing, he was like, oh look, there's sharks. Not a big deal. Yeah, not a big deal. What happens when that great white takes a big bite out of you, huh? Now, although his friends did rescue him from the whale carcass after they, you know, pretty much saw that there were sharks around, he does kind of feel that now that this is done, it was a really bad idea. Why? Because his parents think he's an idiot. If you think riding on a dead whale carcass with sharks around it is a really dumb idea, hit that like button so we know. So Dave, what kind of whale was it? Uh, I don't know. Does it really matter? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. It was a swimming whale. But I thought you said it was dead. Fine, it was a floating whale. Then why is it a floating whale? It's a floating whale because it's dead and it's floating in the ocean. God, <laughs> what? Okay. Got him. So what's your favorite creature in the ocean? Let me know down there. So thanks for watching, guys. My name is Dave Waffle, and as I always say, keep it real, keep it classy, keep it on the flip side. Out there in the real world. Later.